Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Uh, today I'm gonna present you this get ready with me makeup that I did for you. I hope you will enjoy watching this video and welcome back uh, again to my channel because I know um, I wasn't posting anything for a lot of time so now here I am back with you and with this new tutorial. So if you want to see how I did this simple makeup for everyday wear, just keep on watching. Thank you. So after you moisture your face, um, then you will go with a um, foundation and with a brush or sponge or whatever you have home. And I'm using my Rimmel London Lasting Finish 25 Hours 200 Soft to Beige. And the brush is the Zoeva 104 Buffer. I'm applying it all over my face and my neck of course and down on my neck as well. And I'm making sure that I will spread all the product on my face and create this really comfortable look because I'm looking to, to wear this all, all over the day. And yes, after I'm finished uh, with the foundation, I will just set everything with this MAC powder. And I'm using my BH Cosmetic brush, it's a um, synthetic one, but it's really fluffy, I really love it for, for setting powder. So after I set everything very good and is everything in place, I will go in with the concealer from Maybelline in New York Fit Me in color 20. And I will just make sure I will set everything in place with this VH Cosmetics. Um, I think it's actually a concealer brush. I use it for concealer, so, anyways, it's definitely a synthetic one. And after I'm done with um, putting everything in place, I will definitely set everything again with the MAC powder. So guys, for uh, the eyebrows, of course I will brush them first. Because I have this super huge long hair on my eyebrows, so I need to brush them. And then I will go um, in with this one, 317 Wing Liners by Zoeva. I really love this brush, not only for um, eyebrows, but for eyeliner too. And as you already saw, I'm using this Anastasia Deep Brow Pomade in um, shade Auburn. And then I will start filling my eyebrows until I get what I want. And as you may see, after I fill them a bit, I brush them again. Fill them, brush them. So that's my technique in the that period of time to do my eyebrows. I think it's really nice and simple and you can see that the result would be quite a natural one. So yeah, after that, I, as you may see, I am cleaning everything with um, a bit of concealer and then we go to the eyes and I'm using my L'Oreal La Nude Palette or La Palette Nude and uh, this 228 crease brush and I will take this kind of brownie to pinky shade and I will put it in my crease step by step. You don't want to take too much color and to just do something that you will never smudge out or you cannot blend. So make sure you do it step by step easily, you have all the time so don't hurry. <laughs> Thank you. 
So after I'm done with the crease, I will go in with this Maybelline color to 224 hour, hours, 65 pink gold. And together with this Beige Cosmetics brush, I will go and apply this on my lid. So guys, to just finish this uh, this makeup on my eyes, I will go with this 231 Looks Petite Crease by Zoeva and these two shades underneath my eyes because I don't want um, that this uh, eyes makeup to start in a point and to finish in another point. I want everything to be really good spread on my, on my face and you will not see like I did something really sharp or anything like that. So with the same uh, brush as you may see already, I choose this very light color and I will highlight a bit my arcade and then I will go a bit on my nose. So the idea for this makeup was wasn't using a lot of products, that's why I'm doing the highlighter and the eyes with the same palettes. So in this way, you guys will have the chance just buying one product and using it in a lot of ways, which is the best thing ever. <laughs> so the cheeks are nice, <laughs> and I'm using this Beige Cosmetics uh, brush, it's a synthetic one, together with the Maybelline um, Dream Touch blush in shade 02. And as you can see, I'm going with this product till my eyebrows. For the mascara, I will be using the Maybelline New York Jade uh, Lash Sensational Intense Black. At the moment, this is my favorite mascara that I tried so far. Um, because of the brush, I really love it because as you see, uh, I have really long lashes so this is a very important thing for me that my mascara will curve my lashes because I'm not using the special scissors I, or I don't know how even they call them because I never use them. I don't like the idea catching my, um, my lashes with something so yes, that's a very important thing. And then I will mix these two uh, Kiko lipsticks. One, the first one, this one, it is uh, the 902 shade. I don't know exactly the name of it, but definitely you will find it by the number. So it's 902. So yes, that is the look with this light uh, color, beigey, coral, whatever you want to call it. Um, and then I will apply this kind of a ready color up on the other one um, is the same Kiko in shade 810 and that's the final look my dear friends that are watching this um, yes this is a get ready with me tutorial it is a simple makeup look anyone can do it at home as you can see I didn't um, use any expensive products only um, drugery products that you can find at home in your cities anywhere you want to shop some makeup products so yes thank you for watching I hope you enjoyed my video and if you did so please don't forget to show me that with a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel as well I am on Instagram and on Facebook the same here in YouTube of course and what can I say more than guys thank you for watching again I'm definitely back on YouTube I will put a lot of energy in this uh, channel so yes I will see you next time um, very soon uh, with a new makeup tutorial or um, palette review or anything like this so until next time just take care and stay positive